हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज गौतम एंड यू वाचिंग द पार्ट सेवन इन मेकिंग द रियल टाइम चैट एप्लीकेशन इन नोट जी एस एक्सप्रेस जी एस एंड सॉकेट आई सो दिस इज द लास्ट पार्ट इन दिस प्ले लिस्ट सो बेसिकली इन द प्रीवियस टूटोरियल्स वी हैव सक्सीडेड इन मेकिंग ए रियली कूल चैट एप्लीकेशन सो लेट मी शो इट टू यू सो दिस वॉज द चैट एप्लीकेशन सो द रियल फंक्शनैलिटी दैट that was there in this chat application was made so but the last part was remaining that is that is if we write this message a separate message should be printed on to the screen that is this username is typing a message so that functionality was remaining so in this tutorial i will be making this functionality so basically in order to do this i will write some code in the client side so basically first of all i would like to bind a event listener that is on to this message field because as soon as i start to type i would like some action to take place so in order to do so i will simply write message so message is the id name which i have declared right now that is message dot add event listener so i will be binding a key press event listener so as soon as i press any key so this function will execute and i i just have to emit the a typing event typing event so i am naming this typing you can name it anything you want and the corresponding data will be handle dot value because in this case i do not need message because i only need the username who is typing the message so that is because handle dot value so in order to retrieve this value in, in the server side i will be writing a event that is socket dot on same name that is typing and a corresponding callback function will execute with data contained inside it so the server will simply broadcast it to all the clients except me that is who is typing this message so it will simply broadcast to everyone so this message will not be printed in my browser window it will be printed inside another browser window who are whichever the clients which are there in the chat application except me so in order to retrieve this information that is sent by the server we need some mechanism at the client side so we will be writing a event that is socket on same that is typing and i will write a function that is contain data inside it so this function will execute we will have to print this on to the dom that is document object model so we will be using this uh, output feedback id which we have declared in this index.html feedback we will be manipulating it by the inner html property feedback dot inner html is equal to i write some html code it is p m tag plus data plus is typing a message dot 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 just close the m tag and also the p tag and put a semicolon so this completes our entire chat application so let me save it and just illustrate the application to you so let me create two separate windows and click refresh so let me type the username of gautam and as soon as i type the message you will see a message that is there in this window let me type this so as you can see here gautam is typing a message so let me send it so as you can see here this message is still here we need to rectify this so what we can do here is that we can move on to the this as soon as this is printed this is printed inside this chat.js we can go to into this file so what we can do here we can 
remove this inner html of feedback right before this message is printed it is socket on chat function data right before it we can write the first line feedback dot inner html is equal to nothing so let me save it so this will remove the error for me so let me refresh it once again and type gotham and type a message so you can see here gotham is typing a message windows and so show to you let me type a username of gotham and let me type a message so as you can see here as soon as i start to type you can see here message gotham is typing a message click send the error has gone so let me write in this window so you can see here sanjay is typing a message click enter gotham is typing sanjay is typing so we have constructed a fully fledged real time chat application in node js express js and socket io so i think guys you enjoyed this playlist so if you learned something please comment and if you have any doubts regarding this tutorial you can comment and if you like this tutorial please like it and also subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and i will be seeing you in the next tutorial until then thank you very much